The Honourable Member for Vancouver East. Uh, Madam Speaker, I was just listening to this debate, and I'm a little taken aback uh, from the member's comments and the answers to uh, the uh, uh, members of Parliament's uh, questions. It almost appears to me as though she's a climate denier. I wonder if the member is actually aware of the fact that literally the world is on fire. Australia has a wildfire that's going, and it is real. It's climate action that we see that needs to be addressed. We have extreme climate uh, situations where in British Columbia and Alberta, we've had fires, forest fires, and that is very real. Unless and until we actually get on with dealing with the climate crisis, this will continue. And then if we want to talk about e economic prosperity, then we need to actually address what's in front of us today. Because otherwise, it would be future generations who would have to pay for it, and that would not be acceptable. I wonder if the member would actually simply just acknowledge that there is a climate crisis before us today. For, for Renfrew Nipissing Pembroke, very, very brief. Well, I, I was in Australia during the fires, and I do know that over 200 people were charged with arson. But um, worse, worse than ever is the climate of uh, just spending away money without making sure that the money is there to pay for what Canadians need. There.